being healthy on this show. One of the simplest ways to be healthier is to drink the recommended 8 to 12 glasses of water a day. So to help our audience reach that goal, everyone is going to take home a Brita 10 cup capacity brand pitcher, a hard-sided water bottle with a built-in straw, along with Brita replacement filter. So you're set. Enjoy. No excuse now. Along on City Line, we kicked off our hashtag City Line Real challenge right at the beginning of 2015. I am so thrilled at how engaged you are. We throw out a challenge every week. It's all about getting people to be a little bit less fake and a little bit kinder on social media. And I think it's been great. I love the fact that our experts have been weighing in and the viewers are really liking it, that we're, we're sort of trying to change the discourse mm -hmm. on social media. So we wanted to, to show a few of the posts that we've gotten recently. And uh, we encourage all of our viewers to just throw out some real stuff from time to time. Like maybe this one from our expert, Karen Gordon. Check this out, my hot Saturday night date. Don't be jealous. <laughs> it's her laundry. And speaking of laundry, laundry, Trina Rath, one sock box in my laundry room. They've all lost their buddies, but I'm <laughs> sure they're in there somewhere. And then we've got from Charmaine, a uh, sweaty selfie. This is one of the challenges we put, we put out to our viewers. Post a sweaty selfie. This is post a 10K treadmill run. She actually looks pretty good, yeah. but I love the fact that she did this. Mm. And then our very own Leanne Alaire Perot made crispy cauliflower tonight with coconut flour and it tasted meh. Who is a good recipe? I do. Do you? Oh, That's why are you using coconut do. flour? Is that what that was what it's was just wrong? Just do the co co like a cauliflower, olive oil, salt and pepper. Oh, Keep just do the cauliflower by why, itself. Why coconut flour? I don't know. She tried to get fancy. She probably read it somewhere. Leanne. Okay, it didn't work. <laughs> Marilyn Smith, now we know she's a home economist, but check this out. Prepping for City Line. My kitchen is an organized mess. My life is a TV professional home economist. But she put it out there, which is what I, I love. Done. And finally, Amber Bell, I love you more than warm mittens on a cold Canadian day. That was our challenge last week. I love you more than, and we've asked people to put something out. Uh, out there on social media. It's just kind of a nice thing to do. So we were talking a little bit about uh, keeping it real and you found something. Well, yeah, just a commercial break. I mean, listen, I think that psychology always promotes and touts living in congruity, whether it's your avatar yeah. uh, or it's you walking down the street in real life, keeping it real. Walking yeah. the walk, talking the talk, so you don't feel like you're living outside of yourself. That's good and healthy for your psychology. So yeah. in case you don't know how to keep it real, WikiHow gives us a five-step program, starting with maintaining a perspective on what really matters, all the way through to stay true to your commitments. I mean, if we post more things along the lines of keeping it real, I think that we're living more congruous. Do you, you know? do you keep it real on social media? I really Bryce? do. You know, whether I'm running, uh, you know, I, I'm I'm a disaster, and I like I, I post those selfies. You yeah. know, with a strip across my face, sweating buckets. I would like to see you looking like a real disaster because you're like a walking <laughs> you're Kendall. <laughs> you're like a walking. That's very Kendall. kind. I don't Does know if I should take move? that. Is that a compliment? I'm not sure. <laughs> I think so. It's a compliment. You should take very How do I take the selfie when I'm yelling at my daughter <laughs> and hysterical and like waving my finger around? I can't get the photo <laughs> right know. to show me in my terrible parent moment. I know. Well, you know what I do? I'll take the picture and it's a perfect picture and then I'll say, by the way, screamed at my kids 17 times before <laughs> this picture actually turned out. 